Happy New Year's, everybody. We're going to be checking out a video about Dutch fireworks. Um, specifically, right here, we have Dutch fireworks regulations are weird by the channel Posey. So go ahead and uh, check that out. There will be a link in the description section down there for the original video. And we're going to find out about the Dutch fireworks regulations. Um, I do know that fireworks are illegal in the Netherlands, like most of the year until uh new year's and i believe it's like starts at six o'clock p.m on uh december 31st and runs till like maybe midnight or like three in the morning or something i'm not quite sure how long but i do know they go crazy with it i i did post a uh, reaction a couple years ago on how to survive dutch fireworks go check that out i'll try to remember to put a link up there somewhere at the top but anyways we're gonna check it out and we're gonna find out why these Dutch fireworks regulations are weird. This rocket is illegal in the Netherlands. <laughs> okay. Nothing I crazy filmed happened. that in 2010 when it was still legal. When it was still legal? Okay. Nice, right? <laughs> this is a Roman candle. You stick it in the ground and it shoots stars. Huh? A little something like this, which I filmed in 1995. You can see the year in the corner. Oh, yep. I cannot ignite the one I still have because Roman candles are illegal now. Here is a legal version. 60 of them tied together. How's that a legal version? There's more. They go up higher than the other ones. Those ones seem way more unsafe than the the ones that it just showed right this tiny whistle rocket is 30 years old <laughs> nice right it's illegal now in the netherlands bummer <laughs> for you guys and firecrackers no, I'm, just, I'm just playing guys are also illegal now this is technically illegal but this is legal. You can buy this at the end of the year and fire it in the streets. And it goes a little something like this. Jeez. Yeah, that wasn't my fireworks. But this is the first few minutes of 2014. And when I saw this, I realized fireworks had become way too big to light in the streets. Yeah. Too close to houses, and uh, it just seems like a, a, a major fire hazard, for sure. Back to this lovely footage when I was 13 years old. I considered Wait. fireworks one of my hobbies. That was way safer looking. Why is that one illegal, but the other one's legal? Or, yeah, yeah, I think I said it right. But anyways, I guess that's why Dutch firework regulations are weird, right, guys? And every year, I would get a little more. And 11 years later, it looked like this. I decided to light it in a field and make a fireworks show. I even used a remote firing system, which is illegal, because the Dutch law says you may only light it by hand. Wouldn't a remote firing situation kind of make it safer though like less chance of blowing your hand off i don't know maybe i'm reading into it too much there but i don't know that's how i see it but uh go ahead and do me a favor and uh like this video and drop a comment it helps the video uh soar into the youtube algorithm i would appreciate it thank you very strange because a remote is of course safer and exactly. things like this Exactly, I just said that. It, it's, it's a ton safer. Boom. Can be prevented. Thankfully, that was just my car and not someone's eye. So, what's the deal with the Dutch fireworks regulations? Yeah. Through the years, bigger and bigger fireworks became legal. Apparently to prevent illegal import from neighboring countries. But they failed to re-legalize the ones that were previously illegal. I bet that's what it is. But at the same time, small fireworks like rockets, Roman candles, and bangers have become illegal. Oh, so they've since been illegal. Hmm. 
because certain people misused it. Yeah, the video that I watched, uh, How to Survive Dutch Fireworks, that reaction. Yeah, it's kind of like a lot of vandalism, um, a lot of people's mailboxes getting blown up. And I actually had a lot of comments in that video about how a lot of people would just take their mailboxes off the, po the pole or whatever and, and, and hide them <laughs> this time of year to, to prevent that from happening, which I don't blame them. I don't want my mailbox blown up either. This heavy fireworks combined with illegal, even heavier fireworks has resulted in more and more votes for a countrywide fireworks ban. They actually, I, I don't know for sure too much about it, but I'm pretty sure they actually did ban it a couple years ago, but like nobody, uh, nobody really cared. Like they just kept on shooting them off. <laughs> and this year, uh, 2023, um, or 2024 New Year's, right? However you want to look at it. Um, I guess there's 16 different cities that went ahead and banned it, which is weird to me because I thought it was already banned nationwide. Yeah, I don't know. But anyways, there you go. But you could also just make it lighter again, like it once was. New Year 2017, I did my third and last show. Everything worked out and it was a great success. But having those big cakes stored inside didn't feel safe. <laughs> yeah. And when I heard this, it was time to end this hobby. Since then, I mostly just bought some fountains. I see fireworks as an art form and I have the highest respect for those who make it. Oh yeah, some fireworks are just insane. Like they'll blow up and it'll look like a a, a certain shape or like, for instance, here in, in, in uh, the USA, sometimes they'll do fireworks shows and they'll have like a firework explode and it just like somehow is shaped like the American flag or like stars and stuff. And it's like, how in the world do they even, it's just crazy how they design them. Good small fireworks is just as nice. Which is why I still film it. <laughs> but uh, let's end this video with the end of my fireworks show from 2017. It's really nice. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you next year. Yes. Yeah, fireworks are, are fun. They, they really are. Yeah, so there you have it, guys. And again, Happy New Year's. You guys have a super fun, safe time. And I'll catch you in the next one. Take care.